Whoa, here we go again. Ho, ho, ho. Are we going crazy or what, girl? Whoa, what's up with that? Yeah. That looks... I love the color of that. Wait a minute. What's this over Thank here? You. Is that a rock? Oh, no. That doesn't look very <laughs> rocky. <laughs> what is this? It's an elevator. It's an elevator, huh? Yeah. Well, let's like try it. Ride. Let's try it. Oh, whoa, cool. So you can actually climb up on top of that thing with a ladder? Yeah. Yo, what? Let me up, let me up. Oh, that is cool. So it's it's like a crank then? Yeah. I wow, okay. I wow, that's pretty primitive. Huh. Neat. Well, it's wooden. What do you expect? My cool, favorite part bro. is when I let you go, though. Okay, so... We're gonna... I, I just thought this was cool. So you, you might have seen in some videos like yesterday that people were talking about items and stuff well now we actually have everything in aberration so let's take a look at all the items i'm i'm pretty i'm pretty excited for this we were looking through the list and there's some pretty gosh darn cool things man so what do we start with we're gonna do this like the last vid okay so we'll start with of course the hazard suit stuff okay so this is basically what you need to survive gas leaks and everything okay cool we've all heard plenty of that and it looks pretty gosh darn dank, bro. Look at that. I don't know why they use like rubber kitchen gloves for it. So it takes a design that looks really cool and almost turns it into like this silly kind of look. Look at that. Yeah, I feel like I should be watching dishes. Look, what is that hat you're wearing? Stop moving. What is that hat you're wearing? <laughs> it's a cute dino skin. What? I see that there's also now like an otter skin. So they added a bunch of skins then. Oh, that is just creepy. What is that? <laughs> Did they have to make all the skins, like, really, really creepy? That's just weird. What was another one I saw? A skull skin. Yeah, they just added, like, a bunch of super freaky-looking skins to the game. Yeah, what on okay. earth? Uh, like imagine no, people like imagine people running up on you like a group of people running up on you with this that'd be freaky man okay cool so that's the skins are there any other skins to look at here no there's a saddle skin oh show us the saddle skin but we, we don't have the dinosaur oh did on. we look at that in the last video we did oh cool because well we hey guys go check out the last video if you want to see that dino saddle skin where we talked about all the dinos more a little bit a little bit we look at them a little bit closer wow really cool so what else do we have here okay so we've got charge batteries so charge batteries are new and you're even going to be able to use charge batteries to power other things right so have we have we haven't tried it yet but oh look at that gosh Oops. i'm getting distracted by like a butterfly uh Sorry. why don't we try this let's put up a turret so they said the dev said that with charge batteries you'd be able to use them to power other things in the game other old older electrical things so let's try it with a turret real quick i'm gonna put a turret down and i'm gonna put a charge battery in it cool bro go in the inventory Wah! here we go charge battery does it power on no 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 uh maybe it has to be plugged in no that would no that's the whole point of a battery <laughs> Yeah, I just realized oh, wait, but that. Hold on, my charge batteries have no charge. So how do you charge your batteries? With a light plug? Well, um, where's a light bug? Yeah, where'd that thing go? <laughs> I need to try this. Oh, is that thing over there, the green thing, going to be used for that? Oh, yeah, it's got some, ch it's a charge node. That oh my gosh. Wow, cool. Let's let's put batteries in the charge node. And how do they charge? Okay, they're charging. Look at that, guys. So you can charge batteries in a charge node. That's and pretty slick. You can craft tech in here too. Yeah, you can. Well, you can craft Wait a minute, you can craft tech element now. What? Hey guys, so you can craft tech element now in case you didn't know. Okay, cool. We gotta we gotta move faster though. We can't be sitting here for too long. So let me uh transfer all my charge into this one battery and we'll and we'll experiment with this and meanwhile we'll cook the rest of the batteries cool so this is a battery and let's see if a battery can charge a tech turret 
Uh, battery. Oh, sn well, not tech turret, but yo, you can power turrets with batteries, guys. Problem is, it's probably gonna be a pain. I don't know how long a battery charge lasts, but that's cool. Okay, what else do we have? Okay, we've got the glow stick that we've seen in the video. Now, we're gonna need to move fast because there's a lot to cover. So, we've got the glow stick, and you can throw it, and that's cool. Great. I wonder if you can paint them. That's something to try out later. What else do we have? Got my new favorite weapon. What's that? Yo, what? Zap that thing. Hold on, let me try that. Come on. <laughs> let me have some of the fun. I want to zap. No. Here we go. Zap it, bro. Oh, I'm out of Does this actually do anything? Oh, goodness. I threw it. What? 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 I'm confused. If you Right, Wait, is this a turret now? Oh, oh, you can use it as a spotlight. What? Oh, that is cool. That is that cool. Yeah. That okay, is so cool. you can use that as a as a spotlight. All right, neat. Okay, oh, moving on. Okay. Next, we've got the pickaxes, which you've seen enough. So I'll actually skip over that because while I would uh, no, I'm not going to skip over because I want to try it. Gosh darn it. So, it's just left click, so you left click to climb things, and you can go left and right. No, okay, so this is actually really smooth. Cool, so that's the, uh, the pickaxes, and those actually break really fast. We've got pliers, and these are used for repairing, and you da da da, you can repair items in your inventory. So, th these will allow you to repair items in your inventory at a higher cost. That's cool, I get it. Neat. Okay, we've also got ba uh, basilisk sacks. Cool. These are just trophies, basilisk, basilisk fangs. You have a fish basket, which I don't think... We're not next to any fish right now, and I don't know how to get to fish, so we can't really test this right now. This catches fish, and... What you do when you've captured fish is not clear, so that's something to experiment with later as well. We've got the gas collector. Another thing we have seen, and I don't think there's a gas vein nearby, so that's okay. We'll just skip over that one, too. And these are all things that you guys have already seen. We've got the wingsuit, and I was excited to try this one, so hold on. How does the wingsuit work? Okay. So, I'll climb up here. Boom, boom, oh, boom, this. boom, 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 and then I'll jump off. Uh, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know how to use uh, it. Okay, you're, you're getting there. Um, so this is actually kind of a skill thing, then. Uh, yeah. Okay, let me let me climb up here and then Hiya! Wow. Okay, whatever. I don't know how to do this. Okay, I'll play with that later. We've got plant species Z fruit, which will it provides a flash of charge lighting. Okay, we've got the cliff platform in the metal. We've got the Alpha Crab Claw, Reaper King Barb, neat, neat, neat. Got the rock drake feather, cool. Stone cliff platform, tech sleeping pod. Now this is something I actually want to try. Let's take a look at this. All right, and let's put a tech generator down and activate and, okay. Let's see what happened. So is this powered on now? Yep, it is, okay. So while you're laying in the tech, okay, cool. So while you're laying in the tech sleeping pod, what it's gonna do is it's gonna do two things. It's gonna heal you and, and revitalize you with uh, food and water, but also give you an XP boost while you're sitting in the tech sleeping pod. So this is something that can just be passively around your base, and if you have people who are AFK or whatever, they can just sit in that. It doesn't cost anything to, to have running. Okay, so we have that. We got a wood elevator track. Yeah, so we've got all the wooden elevator stuff, which we just saw, which is cool. We've got the, what I showed in another video, the boss battle video, and if you haven't seen that, you're gonna wanna look at that one. So we've got the rail gun, which I'm gonna try on that little son of a gun over there. So give me one sec. I'm gonna take off this hat so it's not blocking my view. And let me get some element. Let's try it, guys. Oh, look at that, I have radar and everything, or, or x-ray. Wow. Cool, bro. It's just like my PUBG games. Let's try this again. This thing has a long cooldown. Okay, so it 
did some damage, but for the cooldown, is this worth using? Oh, okay, actually, yeah. that does a lot of damage. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what level was that thing? Level it's 8? level 8, but I have armor, so... Okay, is there anything else I could shoot? This is cool, though. So it's got... So this will allow you to see things in the dark. So this is actually going to be very useful in aberration for scoping things out. Get it? Because it has a scope. Okay. So the next thing, we've got the zipline anchor. And we've got the zipline motor. And uh, we need a crossbow, right? All right. So we've got our crossbow. So let's figure out how this uh, zipline system works. So we've got the crossbow. We've got the crossbow. Uh, the, the zip line anchor, and what we're going to do is we're going to take the zip line anchor, and I guess, I, I think what you're supposed to do is shoot the ground where you want the first point to be, and then shoot the second, shoot where you want the second point to be, or something. No? It won't let me shoot. Why won't this let me shoot? Okay, I guess you gotta shoot. Okay, I think, wait, what? It'll let me do it in this direction. Why? Why is it only one direction? Uh, mine worked from the hill. That's weird. Okay, so let me try that again. So I, I, or I think you could even do it backwards. Probably not. No, that's not how it works. Okay, so you got to shoot the first point, then you got to shoot the second point, which kind of is weird how it lets you set these things up. Okay, cool. So we've got a zip line, and now the next thing that we can do is we have a zip line motor. Which uses, see how that looks? That's cool. That's an actual, like, attachment. Oh, here we I'll go. So it, it's powered by gas. So you feed it gas and you can jump. What? That was weird. How do I... <laughs> how do I... How do I zip it, though? E? Oh, here we go. So now I've got a zip line motor. And I can go oh, up and down scary. zip lines. Which is going to be so good for getting around. You can just create a network of zip lines, and that's gonna be the bee's knees, dude. Boom. Okay, cool. So that's how the zip line works. And then what else do we have? More resources, gems, that kind of thing. Element ore. So that's gonna be used for crafting element. Fungal wood. What is this used for? I have no idea. Do you know what it's used for, girl? I found that it's just used for wood. It's just another wood. Oh, so it's just another well, type of wood. Okay, so we've got the gas balls. That's more resources. Okay, so we've got mushroom brew. Double, double, toil and trouble. Fire, burn, and cauldron bubble. This is a lovely, lovely mushroom brew. A healthy syrup to protect your pets from radiation. Okay, so if you want to get onto the surface biome, you're going to need to make mushroom brew. So that's what these mushrooms are used for then. Okay, cool. Next, we've got... Nameless Venom, which is used for rock drakes. Cool. We got plant species Z seed. Okay, okay. Plant species Z. Plant this in a viable large crop plot to grow a charge-infused plant that will protect you against enemies and provide you with fruit. Okay, that's cool. Can you make a large crop plot? We'll try that. Okay, we got, uh, da -da -da. we've got Reaper Pheromone Gland. That's interesting. A secretion gland extracted from a Reaper Queen. Perhaps it has some use. What happens if I consume it? What What's going on? What's going on? Oh my goodness. Why are you all foggy? I'm dirty. <laughs> you can see the dirtiness on me. Ew, I'm kind of staying away from you. So what does that do? I wonder what that does. Maybe it attracts nameless or something? Okay, that's another thing we're going to need to look into more in depth. And what else do we have here? Other than that, we've got a shag rug, really cute item. Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. Some sort of cosmetic item. Feels kind of weird, like a little too little too late. Like, why did you add a shag rug? They added a single shag rug and no other cosmetic item to the game. Uh, I don't, I don't understand. And other than that, I mean, I, that looks like we pretty much nailed everything. Other than the portable rope ladder, and let's take a look at that. And I guess you need to assign this to a snap point. Okay. No ground or snap point. But there is ground. So how do I put this thing down? Oh, I'm assuming this is something you have to do on the cliffs. If you if you want to use it, you gotta 
latch it onto the cliffs. Yeah, here we go. So I can go here and here. I'm gonna I'm gonna cheat a little bit, fly, and let's see if I can get this working. It just doesn't want to go down. Okay, whatever. You you get the picture. You know what it does. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's see what this plant does. Boom, boom, boom. Here we go. Plant Z seed. Let's go. I have a speed Astros, hack it's not version. Irrigated. Okay. There we go. Shoot it. Shoot it. Do your thing. Wait. No. It, what, what, it's got like no options. What's, what's it do? Come on. Go. Shoot it. Yeah. There's no options. I can't hold D on it and do any options. Okay. You know what? It's just not interesting. It's what I got a rail gun for. And I seriously missed that shot. Unbelievable. I need to play some PUBG. Wow, okay. Haha. <laughs> I love that gun. That's the bee's knees, man. Alright, so I made a bit of a mistake, and I said, like, this was a seed, but no, it's actually a fruit that comes off of this plant. So I thought this plant would shoot things, but I guess not. What it does do, though, is give you these grenades, and what do these grenades do? They make flashes of light. Oh, cool. Look at that. That is scary. Look at that! Does this actually do damage? Oh wow, I can, I can just flashbang myself, what the hell? Oh no, they're ringing! They're ringing in my ears! Ha! Oh gosh, stop! I love I can't it! See anything! I'm blind. It doesn't work on me, does it work on you? Throw one at me! Here, let me get one. <laughs> Throw one at me, come on! I mean, I can see still. It's just, I'm, it's a little bit bright. That's it. I cannot see a thing even throwing them at you. Really? Yeah. Okay, so it's not that bad, but... Yeah, okay, there we go. Flashbangs! Alright, so that's pretty much a quick... I mean, that's, a, that's kind of a quick look through all of the items in Aberration. There's a lot to this that we don't know yet. But you know what? Stick around and we're gonna find out, guys! Make sure you subscribe with notifications. Because there's going to be a lot, lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of more videos coming out. I'll see you guys in the next video.